Are you a keen observer? Have you noticed the faces on the branches of the tree? If you don't, let's take a look again. Now you'll see. But, did you count the number of faces on the branches of the tree? <laughs> I bet I got you there. And that is what we will be talking about today. I'm Sir Jamel De La Paz and welcome to my science class. Being observant is a very good characteristic of a scientist. It takes experience and focus to make a meaningful observation. Did you feel bad about the faces on the branches of the tree? Don't worry. Let us put your observation skill in a series of tests. Are you ready? Let's begin. Give at least one observation about this image. Did you just say the mango is color yellow? You are correct. Make at least two observations about this image. There are two white eggs. Very good. There are two ways on how you will make an observation. It could be a qualitative observation or quantitative observation. Qualitative observations focus on the quality of the object like the color, the texture, and the shapes. While quantitative observations focus on the number or count of the object. I'll be giving you one minute to write your answer on your notebook. Tell whether the given observation is qualitative observation or quantitative observation. Did you get them all? Very good! Get ready because you will be engaged to another set of tests. I'll be giving you another one minute to write your answer on your notebook. It's your time to make your own quantitative observation or qualitative observation on the following object. Game!
Wow, you are making progress, aren't you? This time, get ready for the last set of steps. You will be making your own quantitative and qualitative observation on the following object. Very good! You can now use your observation skills to make meaning in life. Use them properly and for sure you will see the beauty of life. I am Sir Gemma de la Paz and see you again in my next class.